with the bleed. I'm at a different degree. If you ain't trying to reach your goals, you can't kick it with me. If you thirsty about some hoes, I give them dick for the free. And have a walk in pigeon toe to the lift when she leaves. What's going on, YouTube, man? It's your boy St. Stories coming at y'all another video, man. I can see better title. I had to throw the hoodie back on, man. Chicago is, is, is cold as hell, you feel me? It's not cold as hell, but it's real windy and shit, you know what I'm saying? So I had to put my hoodie back on, you feel me? But you guys, as y'all can see better title, man. Yeah, like, you feel me? It, everything can turn from something good, you feel me, to something just bad, you know what I'm saying? We were just all at the table playing, you know, Monopoly. Like, the whole family besides my mom, you feel me? I don't know if she knew how to play Monopoly a lot, but... I don't think she ever played with us or not, but all I know, I ain't know she was in the living room, and the living room was, like, right where I was at, because I'm thinking she in her room the whole time, you feel me, so that really just, it happened out of nowhere, you feel me, so, and at that age, I still am a sore loser, you feel me, I don't like to lose, especially when I'm on a game, I'm playing 2K or something, or, like, Call of Duty, and I keep dying, or if I'm, like, or oh, we lose, you know, on the court or anything, I really get fucking mad, y'all. Y'all don't want to see that side of me. But you guys, before we get to the video, man, how y'all day going, man? What y'all up to today, man? We're like, like, what's up? Like, talk to your boy. But without further ado, you guys, man, we finna get straight to this video. I checked out YouTube. Okay, it was me, my three brothers. So that's four. Plus one, two. Plus three of my cousins. So that's seven. And then somebody else was, you feel me? And we was all at the table playing fucking monopoly okay but we all weren't playing someone was just there just watching and then i was one of them that was playing though you feel me i can't tell y'all which who actually which who was playing but all i know we all just get the table and we was playing monopoly okay and like the shit just went left like out of everybody i'm the one that got in trouble so then you guys the whole fucking time you feel me i'm not getting nothing good you feel me i'm not getting no property you feel me i kept getting sent to jail so I kept building up on me, you know what I'm saying? And I just kept getting mad. I'm like, yo, like, I don't even want to play no more. Because I kept telling him, like, I don't want to play no more and shit. Then I just found myself back playing again, you feel me? But, guys, this whole time, I'm thinking my mom is asleep, you feel me? Because I'm like, she quiet. The living room wasn't nothing. You couldn't hear a pin drop in the living room. The living room was right by the kitchen, you feel me? So I couldn't, you couldn't hear anything in the living room. So I'm like, like, my mom must be asleep. I just assumed she was asleep, so... Well, my mom usually go to sleep or she's not around. You feel me? me and my cousins, we'll be cursing, you know, things like that, doing what we're not supposed to be doing. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I did what I did. So you guys, at this same time, my older cousin, he went around our age. He was like older. Him and his girlfriend, which is his wife now to this day, she was, they was outside. So after I had like lost in the Monopoly shit, after I really got enough of this shit, I'm like, bro, I'm done playing. You feel me? I'm about to go outside. Like, so mind you, my, they was outside in the backyard, so my mom is this way, you feel me? I go that way to go outside, you feel me? Because they was in the backyard. So then, like, I go outside with them, and I'm talking to my cousin and his friend, my cousin and his girlfriend, and I was like, you feel me? They didn't want me to be outside either, because they wanted, like, a long time. You know how people be when you with your girl, leave with your boyfriend, and they be like, why'd you here? Like, we trying to talk, you feel me? Like, if I want to, you feel me, do what I want to do to her, I can't, because you standing right here, you feel me? So... You know how they give you the signal, like, they know you, they don't want you around, so I already knew, like, there, yeah, I'm, like, but I was outside with them for a little bit, just to try to, um, talk to, like, my cousin and girlfriend, because I wanted her to put me on with, like, hook me up with some of her, like, cousins, her, uh, female friends, or any fucking, not female friends, she was too old for me, but, like, her cousins, like, or somebody she knew that was my age, because at that age, I was, what, 13, I think, I think I was about 13, and I was, like, you ain't got nobody, she was, like, well, I don't know nobody that's your age you can talk to. You know what I'm saying? You too young, you feel me? She it was at least like 20 something and I was like 13. And then I was messing with my cousin, cause my cousin, he always messed with me, you know what I'm saying? When, at, when I was like when I was like 13, he'd be 20 something, he'll always like punk, not punk, really punk on me, but he'd be like, it's cause he older me. He'd be like, Yeah, little cuz, you feel me? Like he'd be messing with me and shit. So I was getting him back. I'm like, shit, like I could take you from my cousin and shit like that. My cousin right there too. He was like, how don't tell me he'll beat my ass and shit. So I'll beat your ass on it. Don't say that shit, you feel me? I was getting payback on him, you feel me? Because what he be saying to me and shit. So I'm like, you feel me? All right, man, you feel me? So I'm like, you ain't got no cousins, no, you feel me? No nothing. You feel me? I asked her this one last time before I went in the house. She was like, nah. And then she was like, she said, nah, now get your, he was like, now get your ugly ass back in the house and shit like that. So I'm like, all right, I'll take that. You feel me? I am ugly, you feel me? I'll take that. You call me ugly and shit. You know, fuck it. I'll take my black ugly ass back in the house. So then you guys, like, I go back in the house, you feel me? Now, they was playing Uno and shit like that, but I told them, like, I'm trying to play again, you feel me? So they had finished their game. Um, I said Uno. I 
Monopoly. I keep saying Uno and shit, but Monopoly. And I just got done playing Uno like a couple hours ago and shit. That's why I keep saying Uno and shit, but Monopoly. I catch, got done playing Monopoly and shit. Okay, let's cut this story short right here, you guys. Not cut it short, but let me tell y'all something. This is the reason I came out with the story time for y'all today, you feel me? Because that Uno game we were just playing is the reason why I brought it. It, it made me think like, damn, you, you could put that, tell them that story about when you got your ass beat from playing Monopoly and shit. Because when I, I was cursing upstairs uh, just a few hours ago, and my aunt, she kept telling me like, can you stop cursing, please? You feel me, please? And I just kept doing it. Because I, I used to... Because cursing is like a habit for me, you know? So I'm trying to, like, stop doing it. So it, it really brought back memories. I'm like, damn, I remember that time my mom, she, you feel me, got on my ass because I was cursing. But you guys, so I went back in the house, you feel me? Getting back to the story. I went back in the house, and I go to the table. You feel me? I'm like, put me on in the game, you feel me? I'm trying to play. They was like, all right, the game about to be over with. So they put me back in. So then you guys, I'm not even going to give y'all the detail of the fucking game. You feel me? I'm going to just let you tell y'all this like this. You feel me? This is the reason why I stopped playing that game. I haven't played Monopoly probably since then. I kid you not, I haven't played Monopoly since then. Because every time I play, things never go well for me. You know what I'm saying? It's always on the, the bad end. You feel me? I always get sent to jail. You feel me? I don't ever get no property. You feel me? I ain't ever got no fucking money, you know what I'm saying? So it's always on a bad end for me, you know what I'm saying? So at that time again, you feel my mom in the living room still. And I didn't know she was in there because she was like, she'd be in the dark or she'd be on like, she'd be in the dark like on her DS and like she had a volume all the way down because my mom, she ain't like to volume up on her shit, on her game. So then like she had it all the way down and she had to be playing it like with the little uh, stylus she used to have. She had to be playing it. So you, you can't hear nothing out of it. So then, like, I didn't know she was in there. So then, like, I'm, I get back in the game and I'm playing, you feel me? Th Once again, things are not going good for me and shit. So I'm mad, you feel me? I'm hitting the table like, man, like, what the fuck, you feel me? And then my cousin, he's just damn laughing. I'm like, it's not funny, dickhead, you feel me? Because my cousin, uh, he he always calls dickheads and shit. He had called me and my cousins dickheads, you feel me? So I'm like, that shit sound cold, you feel me? I'm going to start saying that, you know what I'm saying? So then I would follow my cousin footsteps. With the one that was outside talking to his girlfriend. So I called my cousin a dickhead and shit like that. So once I called him a fucking dickhead, I'm like, it ain't funny, dickhead. You know, he just still down laughing and shit. All I know, I'm playing, you feel me? I'm looking down at the table. My head is towards the doorway, you feel me? I'm playing just like this. It's not like it's a mirror right here. I could just see my mom coming in, you know what I'm saying? So I'm playing, you feel me? All I know, mom come up behind me, slap the fuck out my neck. I'm talking about straight neck like it was a fucking cheap shot like a that nah i ain't gonna say a cheap shot i mean you say this in my own fucking terms you feel me it was a expensive shot you feel me that shot was worth at least you feel me a hundred thousand dollars you know what i'm saying that shot she just gave me she smacked me right on my fucking neck you feel me she was i was like it ain't funny dickhead and then i started cussing him out and shit like that like i know i called him a pussy too all type of shit because i thought my mom was in my room in her room sleeping she wasn't she came in the kitchen Slap my neck, you feel me? I'm like, turned around, oh. Oh, shit, I did not know she was in there. You feel me? She, what the fuck did you just say? I'm like, nothing. You feel me? So then she, go get the broom. Yes. She went and got the broom on me. My mom, she was the type, well, like, she'll whoop you with any fucking thing. You feel me? So she was too lazy to go in her room and get her switch, her paddle, or, you know, her belt or anything. She went and got the broom. And I went from sitting in a chair to being on the floor in the corner, balled up. You know, she was hitting me with the broom and shit like that. She broke the broom on me. You feel me? So she, we had to get another broom because she only got the broom out the corner. And she got, what the? So you think you grown and shit? Beating the fuck out of me. I'm like, no, nah, I don't think I grown. I, I thought you was in your room and shit. So she was like, that make it right for you to curse? Do you think I'm in my room? So that's what y'all do? Y'all curse when I'm not around and shit like that? So then that's my mom started watching us and shit like that, like, listening to us and shit like that. But we still quiet enough, like, to cuss and shit like that. Like, mom, come on now, I'm 13. Like, and I told her, like, mom, I'm 13. Which I'm not told her that shit, she, motherfucker, you ain't grown and shit. So she started hitting me some more. And that's when I, she broke the broom on me and shit when I said, mom, I'm 13. Like, the fuck? Because you know how when you turn 13, you turn into a teenager, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, like, a young teenager, so... She thought it because I was saying I'm 13, I'm a teenager, that I can curse all I want to. After she beat my ass with this fucking broom, the broom breaks, you feel me? The broom literally breaks on my fucking thigh. She hit me in the thigh, 
and the shit broke. You feel me? Then after it broke, because it was like one of them little cheap brooms. After it broke, she took it and she started hitting me with the little, the part that broke off, the piece that broke off, not the broom. So she put the broom down, she started hitting me with the piece that broke off, and she started hitting me. I had like whips all on me and shit like that. She dropped it, threw it in the garbage. No, she dropped it, told me to throw it in the garbage. And she went back in there and went to go play her damn game and shit. She told me, I can't stay up for the rest of the night. Take my ass to bed. You guys ain't gonna lie. If she said go to bed, I was like, all right, man. You know what I'm saying? My cousin had came in the house. His girlfriend outside. He was like, I guess he told her, hold on. He came in the house. He see me getting my ass beat. I guess he went and told her, damn, he getting his ass whooped right now. You feel me? So then I go back. Then I go to my room. I go to sleep. You feel me? And that was that. You feel me? I'm like, I ain't listen. I ain't got nothing to say to. You know, I'm still mad at my cousin I'm because of the fucking game. You know what I'm saying? Y'all think y'all better than me because y'all was winning. You know what I'm saying? Y'all was doing better than me on this damn game. Like, I literally was, was doing the least, you feel me, best on the game each fucking time I played this shit. Like, I just, it's either that I just didn't know how to play. Like, I don't know what the fuck it was, you feel me? And after that, my mom, she always beat her ass one night and then get up the next morning like nothing happened. Like, you didn't just beat the shit out of me last night. I mean, you, you remember when you beat me last night when you was beating the fuck out of me? Oh, okay. Fuck it. But you guys, man, that's the video, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the story time, and I got more story time to come for you guys. 25, 8, 24, 7. You name me, if I knew on the channel, you like story time. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. on the post notes in the comment box. Let me know what you guys think of the video. How can I put it in the video? Now, if you don't know, now you know. Be safe. We got dumb ass out doing dumb shit. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. My subscribers, my viewers. You feel me? Even if you scroll past my channel, I appreciate you for scrolling past. You feel me? Not really, but you know what I'm saying? Next time, click on that motherfucker. Well, we gonna have to throw them bitches, yo. I'm just, just letting you know, you feel me? Until next time, we gonna wrap it up right here. It's your boy Insane Stories. And I'm gonna catch you guys next video. <laughs>